bounce around. There we are. Let's have a little bit, turn a little bit into the sun, shall we? Shall we? A little bit into the sun. Hello, how are you? It's me, Craig, the diet beast, the diet demon. Uh, I finished my 12 weeks of having nothing but soups and shakes. Uh, and as per the NHS wishes, I'm now on nothing but pizza, Burger King, McDonald's. That's all I eat now. And hey, presto, I'm not putting on any more. Well, I am. I'm not. I am. It's not been good last week, to be honest, because I got a little bit ahead of myself. I thought, well, you know what? Celebrate 12 weeks. Get yourself a pizza. And that'll be it. So that's what I did. I ordered myself a pizza. I ate it across two days and um, it, it tasted really bad. It tasted very sugary. Uh, I had no idea there was that much sugar in a pizza. It's all in the barbecue sauce and stuff that they use, the ketchup. And lost loads of sugar in it and I, 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 I never knew it tasted so sweet. So that uh, was my first downfall. And then because of uh, unforeseen circumstances, I forgot to bring my shakes and I had to have a, I had to eat something so I had one day I had a uh, egg and cress sandwich from Marks and Spencer's and then I think the next day I had the same uh, I definitely had a sausage sandwich a hot sausage sandwich and I'm like Argh. I've got you for ages and uh, I'm thinking you know when I'm doing it I'm thinking that's all right I'm never gonna do it again I'll be fine I'll be fine we'll be fine and that's what happened and then I came to weigh-in day, which was Monday. This is uh, this is Tuesday. Uh, I weighed in on Monday, and lo and behold, <laughs> I did not repeat. I did not um, lose any weight in my last week. I didn't do it. I didn't lose anything. So uh, let's. What happens next? You're possibly wondering. Well, I'm now in a process of being weaned back on to normal foods or off the uh, the shake and their soup diets um, which I'm not really too happy about to be honest with you because there's I'm starting been having all these like recipes coming at me that are like I don't like the sound of that and also I need stuff that I can go out on the road with and I can't you know these are all prepared meals lightly brown chicken and have it with a salad it's like, I can't do that if I'm out on the road so I need to have something I can squeeze into a flask and just take out my backpack um, and this is the you know danger zone for me because the temptation when you're tired of just like oh there's the golden arches i'll just pop in there and it's only once that i'm doing it and i've already i recognize that um getting fast food straight away is not i've got to we mustn't think of food like that as a treat it's not it's 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 punishment because it's it's addictive food i find because it's delicious it's absolutely delicious and it's so easy delicious relatively cheap and you can it'll be delivered to your door and that's that temptation to all i gotta do is on my computer is go to that website and two two minutes that's ordered it's 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 a horrible horrible frustration to to know i'm still going to be combating that um, but i've not lost uh, i'm not where i want to be size wise and I know I'm not doing this for size, but I sort of personally feel like I've cracked the diabetes 2 uh, situation. I think I'm on top of that by the very fact that, I, um, uh, that I've lost so much weight. And all my, my blood glucose numbers are good, my uh, blood pressure is good. Uh, so because I haven't, my phone is being used to record this, because my cat, I forgot to bring a card for my camera, uh, I'll put my final weight here. That's my final weight. What do you think? Well, the thing is, it's not my final weight. So I'm going to continue making videos like once every month or so just to um, update you with how it is. Now, I think this is going to be the hardest part. Um, the plan is that week one, uh, I will have two shakes in the morning and then I'll have a 400 calorie meal in the evening. Uh, and that might be chicken and rice maybe or chicken salad or it might be like an omelette. This is what I'm thinking in my head at the time, at the moment. And I think I'm just gonna have to like, have it late when I get in, which could be quite late. 
But I think that's how it's going to have to be. Um, Styring myself up until like eight o'clock at night. I'll survive. I don't like going to bed with a meal in me. Really, I want to have. I want to have it like around about five o'clock if possible, and then not eat anything after six, something like that. <clears throat> um, so I do that for a week. So that's two shakes and a 400 calorie meal. And then I think it's gonna do the week after that, it's one shake and two 400 calorie meals. And they're, and they're basically trying to work, work me up to get me up to like, I think I do 1200 calories a day and then it's gonna become like, uh, 1600 or something I don't really know the exact numbers because I don't really like the idea of calorie counting that's that's why you know I've never got on well with calorie counting reading packets how much is in that and what's in this and uh, I think I might I did get like the slim fat not the slim fast the uh, slimming world meals so these videos will be quite interesting I think to to see the, the sustainability of dieting um, I want to lose at least another two stone and I can do it uh, without any problem because the reason you're not seeing a full but what by the way do you want to see what I looked like when I started these videos I should where's the Sun this is what I looked like but like that weeks. guy there look at him I've got to have four of these a day it's not me and nothing else I don't know how long I'm supposed to do this for Anything read the instructions I should have read the instructions So he's he's gone now. It's now it's me, so, but I'm gonna get even weir. We me is the plan. A bit more muscly. Um, I've had a few sort of issues with anxiety and stuff of late, and I'm not sure if that's diet related or not. I think it's to do with pressures of work, but uh, it's certainly been the case that I've had that. Uh, but uh, it's impossible for me to know what the cause of that is. But it's new. And I don't know why it's happened and the diet is something that's also new in my life so I don't know I think I definitely need to get my stamina up and maybe do a little bit of weights because I'm a bit wimpy get these bingo wings firmed up and then we'll be um, right as rain I'll be exactly like I was when I was 22 years old you know this is <laughs> dieting and all this process is, does not turn back time uh, if I could turn back time then I would. And I know you're all thinking of a share song then. It was deliberate. Anyway, that's pretty much the story so far. Uh, do stay tuned uh, for my, I might, I might, I don't know how often I'm gonna do it. But also, by the way, I'm out and about walking. Um, I did make a video, I filmed it, uh, and there was a massive technical mess up on my part, just like this. I, my, I didn't mean the card for my camera and I've come all the way out here to the countryside. And I haven't, I'm not prepared. I'm just not thinking straight. So uh, bear with me, bear with, bear with. And uh, well, I'll get you back out in the countryside with me soon. And we'll do some circular walks and you'll help me. And together we will, uh, well, I'll show you the beautiful Yorkshire countryside or wherever it is I am. Anyway, I'm rambling now. Uh, thanks for watching these. Oh, and by the way, thanks for your supports and your comments. I've really, really appreciated them. They, they have all been read and seen and uh, I might not reply to all of them because I see them on my phone when I'm doing other things so uh, but I do see them I see you and I hear you and if anyone wants any sort of um, advice from me about what it's been like uh, they get in touch uh, the app is a big part of it so any questions around that I'd quite like to know how you're getting on with it with the app and your support worker whatever they're called uh, it's not been fantastic that side of it and the app has been okay but not perfect let me know what you think anyway for now from me cheerio thanks for your support through the last 12 weeks of my life and uh, here's to the next 12 months uh, so till next time cheerio take care and if you can't take care then uh, call an ambulance I guess <laughs>